Good morning guys, welcome back. This is day two of SEMA, for us at least. Um, it's day four of the event, but today I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna walk around. I think I'm just gonna show you guys the cars that I think are the, the best builds that are here at the show. It's really not that, really not too much to today um, since we leave tonight, but make the most of it. So, so I just looked at a set of gram lights for my car. That's one of the wheel choices I was thinking of getting before. Uh, I just don't know what I want to do with my car. Like originally, I'm, I'm just telling you guys, I was going to do carbon fenders um, and just a nice set of wheels and just leave it like that for a little bit. And then I was eventually going to wide body it. But now that we're here, it just makes me want to just go wide body right away. So I don't know what exactly I'm going to do. So like this is what I'm talking about when I say that I just want to wide body it right away. When I see stuff like this and it's done absolutely perfect, it makes me just want to do the wide body kit for my car right away. Um, so we'll decide, but we'll talk about that more when we get back home. We have to be able to feel on this thing. Yeah, it's fantastic. <laughs> this thing is nuts. know how I feel about carbon. Full carbon trunk. I don't know if you guys can see it. Look at the hard line setup back there. Uh, there it is. Kind of see it. Something a lot of people don't know about me is I actually own a third gen Camaro as my first car. Uh, this is an 85. That's an 85 IROXY. I had an 87 IROXY. It was nowhere near this, but this Looking at this is crazy because this is something I never did to mine. And this is not at all what an 87 Camaro looks like. The only thing that looks the same is the gauge cluster, but if you guys don't believe me, that was my first Camaro. This is nasty. This is sick because this is like this is little details that I love. These barrels are forged carbon. Barrels are forged carbon and then all this trimming. Like that is insane. That's forged, that's forged, it's all this. The detailing on the exhaust is sick too. One day, one oh, day, yeah. one day. And in line to get pins. How old are we? I'm 12. Uh, I'm so, yeah, give me one sec, give me one sec. Do what? We met you yesterday and I forgot to thank you. I won the Gary Turbo that you came away last year. Really? I did. Hell yeah. And I came oh, to for the with, for the 25 yes, days. Ago. I did. I got the email. I was watching your video and you're like, oh, if you don't have a license plate frame, you should buy one. It's like, fuck it, I don't have one. I bought it. And I won. Oh, oh dude. dude. I've been watching you for five years. Back then I won. Yeah. That's fucking like awesome, man. Like in fan man. experience. Hell like yeah. Dude. Have you put it as it, it, yeah. what, what size did you order? What did you? Um, uh, I was like, someone could potentially win this without a car with a turbo, could yeah. be an A, but I was like, if someone plays their cards right, they just buy a solid turbo, they can keep it, or even resell it for all that matter. So I got a Rocket Bunny 350Z that I built, and I don't have the turbo on it yet, but I'm debating of boosting my current motor, or I have a uh, BQ30 DET, which came stock turbo on the Glorias. So I'm debating on putting it on that. I'm trying to figure out my best options, because I don't like Okay, do you want my advice? Yes, please. Do not turbo the BQ. Okay. Don't do that. Okay. Do, I am telling him the same thing. Do not do that. Yeah, I even think, um, I don't know too much about boosted BQs, other than they don't like it. They work, they do it. If anything, I would supercharge it if you really want to boost that bad. But especially that turbo size too, I don't even, what size turbo was it? Uh, I have to look, I talked to the Garrett rep and he's the one that- Had like uh, suggested what to do? Yeah. Yeah. See, that's, that's where you'll- Pick which one you want. Dude, you I, have a tough choice. Honestly, I, it's a really tough choice. I think or you I'll, can have both if you want both. No, you, you enjoy one. I'll, I'll take the original one. Thank you. I, ooh, it's nice and cold, too. Yeah, Hell yeah. Went this morning I, told you, I told you yesterday I'll bring you a knot. Hell so yeah. I appreciate it. That was very abrupt on what just happened. So we were standing there. We saw Kevin. So we, started, we decided that we were going to start talking to Kevin. We started talking to Kevin. Um, and then... After that happened, Anthony started asking me what camera stuff I was using. 
Uh, me, and him, me, him, and Kevin started talking about camera stuff because we're all shoot Sony. Sony's better. Sony's better. That's fine. I don't they take pictures. I don't even vlog. It's better for f footage too. No, but we all use Sony, so he, we started talking about um, camera gear, like nerds. And then after we started talking about camera gear, we just see TJ slip in with his hood on, and then he started talking to us. So we had. Yeah, but he was real busy, so but white perforated leather. that was cool. Okay, you already know me, but which wheel on this wall would I choose? Um, uh, not that one. No, it's not that one. I don't think it's that one either. Which one, which one do you actually think Obviously the carbon one. Yeah, either that or this is probably the one. No, it's, it's between these two. If I had the choice, this one because it's Alcantara, but I think carbon. You already know me, carbon. Actually, there's a wheel in here that I actually really like that I'm pretty sure you'd be very surprised that I like. I'm gonna say the red one because it's the one I basically. No, it's the one right next to Oh, the color one? This one? I don't know what about it. That is sick. I would run that. Let's just stack two of those on the top of your Z. Why on the top of my card? No, let's put them on the top of the Z. Okay, so me and him, me and Esteban, we're just checking out this RS6. First off, this thing's beautiful. But then he asked me, is this the stock ride height where it's at? And he's like, well, it's probably on coils. And we started debating on the wheel size because these things are ginormous. I just checked, I just took a look. What size do you think these are? Definitely, I think you're pretty much right about 22s maybe they're 22s yeah these are 22s and it doesn't look bad at all on this car but i think, I, I think I this am, is one of the only cars that you can throw 22s on it and not be like ah, that looks like shit this like it looks good for how big they are the fact that we leave tonight and i have to carry all my stuff in my backpack and we have to around this venue right now my back is in so much pain how is yours? How is yours holding up? It's not terrible. I mean, my shoulders are kind of heavy right now, but it's not terrible. I don't have as many lenses and stuff as this guy does, though. Yeah, my back is in so much pain right now. I'm carrying around so much camera equipment and clothes and a bunch of other stuff in my bag right now because we're he literally heading straight from here probably to the airport. So I'm on my own for the next like hour, hour and a half ish. So I'm just gonna walk around and I'm gonna continue to show my favorite builds. So because I'm alone, I'm just going to walk around and I'm going to start showing, I'm just going to start showcasing my favorite builds because I haven't really done a really good job doing that. Here's one of the cars. Full carbon fiber C8. That is the prettiest C8 I've ever seen. There you go. Now you can see it. Literally the entire car is carbon, so this is, this is up there with one of the most beautiful cars. Honestly, I don't even remember the last clip I filmed. I've been just walking around by myself for a while, but this venue is so big. I'm not used to this, but I am, I am loving this experience. It's something I'll probably never forget.
We had all of this. Like, I was just, I was so tired. All in all, it's a good trip. I don't know, guys. I really want to use white bodies of the RC right away. I know. I don't know. After seeing all the cars over there, that's like the biggest thing I want to do. Um, I guess we'll just find out what happens. But I'm tired. I'm pretty sure you're tired. So, see you guys when we're back at home.